Hey, welcome to another, it's not another dev journal, it's just uh, me talking about Blender. Um, so I figured something out after a lot of searching and trying to figure out how to do something properly. Um, putting in the animations so that they go into Blender the way they're, or go into Unity from Blender the way they're supposed to, or how you want them to be. Um, if you'll notice here, if I click the animation data here, I got idle and I got swing. And if I go into Unity, I have idle and swing. Um, it seems like you're always going to have a default take. I don't really understand why. I think that's just the way Unity does it. So just kind of ignore that one. But it does exist and whatever. It's not that big of a mess. It's, it's better than doing the split animation thing. After screwing around with this a lot, basically what I figured out was if you click the F, that will save um, these individually. So what you'd have to do is if I, ch if I go to add here, I've got a new one. And I can change this to uh, golf, I suppose. I hit F. Now I have all of these. If I didn't hit F when I reopened this, uh, I'll just go ahead. I'll save it right now so you see it's saved. Now I'm going to go back into Blender. Blender. Open up to Katana. And hey, golf's still there. Weird. Oh, it's probably some open. Watch this. Whoops. Now if I save it and. What am I doing? <laughs> Going. Okay, now golf's not there. So basically, what you have to do is you have to ensure that you hit F for each animation, otherwise, it doesn't save it like it's supposed to. And all you really have to do is make your animation like you want it. For example, I created a swing animation. Just make put your keyframes in like you would normally animate it. Then hit the plus, and then type in the name, then hit F, or click the F. After that, you can just cycle between all your different animations, and that's pretty much all there is to it. Um, after that, it'll import right into uh, Unity like you expect it to, and um, yeah, that's it. So uh, it's actually pretty easy. If you don't know how to get to this NLA editor part, all you do is you go to one of these. Normally, if you drag this, win drag a window out, it'll start off as this. Just uh, go down here, click the little box, switch it over to uh, where to go. NLA editor, and there you are. Um, you can click this if you want to blend animations. This is for if you want to like have a idle shoot type of thing going on. Um, I really don't know much about that just yet. I think that's more for animating within Blender. But uh, cause I think Unity does its own blending. But um, yeah, that's it for all for now. Uh, thanks for watching. If you liked, if this was helpful, please like, subscribe. Also check out my game Apocalypse Dot. I have a lot of dev journals up for it. And I appreciate any of the help that you uh, can give me as far as uh, supporting me on that. So until next time, have a nice day there.